Greetings, back again here with another pickups video. And the first uh, few items here I picked up at a uh, flea market this past weekend. And the first game here is uh, Sonic Gems Collection for the PlayStation 2. And this is a collection of uh, nine different uh, Sonic games. We got uh, Sonic CD, Sonic uh, the Fighters, and uh, Sonic R. And then there's uh, six uh, Game Gear games. And those are Sonic the Hedgehog 2, Sonic Spinball, Sonic the Hedgehog Triple Trouble, Sonic Rift 2, Tails Sky Patrol, and uh, Tails Adventure. And uh, apparently there's uh, some uh, unlockables as well. So if we open this up here, you can see it's uh, complete. And uh, the disc is in really good condition. There's no scratches or any marks on it. So, and uh, the manual and yeah, everything here is uh, in really good condition. And uh, from the same seller, I also got uh, Kid Sports uh, Ice Hockey, also for the PlayStation 2. And uh, these were the only two games he had, so I picked them both up. And this is complete as well. And again, uh, really good condition on the disc. Uh, no scratches on this either. Uh, initially he wanted uh, 25 kroner each for these, but uh, I got them for uh, 40. So that's uh, roughly, I don't know, about 6 US dollars I think. So, not too bad for two games. And from another seller at this uh, flea market, I picked up a PlayStation 2, uh, oh, sorry, PlayStation 2 uh, console, and it's the fat one. And this came with an official 8 meg uh, memory card and a, uh, well, actually a an RF cable, which is uh, somewhat unusual. It's uh, usually a, a composite cable, but uh, this one came with an RF cable. And it also came with a controller, which unfortunately is not working. And uh, you can see I've started uh, taking it apart here, see if I can uh, fix it. But uh, I have a few uh, uh, spare controllers, so uh, if it doesn't work, it's uh, not that big of a deal. And also, it didn't came with uh, a power cable, but uh, since the uh, PS2 uses a, a standard cable, uh, I have a few spares, so I have a cable for it. And uh, supposedly, there were no games with it. Um, but uh, when I came home and uh, plugged it in and started it up, uh, it actually began to load. So I checked the uh, uh, the disk tray, and I found a copy of uh, Medal of Honor Vanguard in there. So uh, apparently I had forgotten this in the system, and uh, he told me uh, this had been sitting in his uh, closet for a few years so he probably for, forgot about this so got uh, at least uh, one game with it uh, now I just need to find a, a case for it and uh, a manual for it so that's uh, all the stuff I got at uh, the flea market and then uh, today I got uh, a package in the mail and this comes all the way from Germany actually and uh, these are uh, some Master System games as I mentioned before I'm uh, going for a full PAL Master System collection so I bought these uh, games via an uh, auction 
let's see if I can get this bag out of here. So let's see here. We have uh, Captain Silver. Uh, can open this up here. Can see it's uh, complete. And we have the manual here, and the cartridge, of course. Let's see what this is. Looks to be a poster as well. Yeah, we have a, a poster here of uh, the light phaser and uh, the th uh, 3D glasses and the control stick and regular uh, control pad and the various uh, master system uh, bundles here, the, the base system, master system and the SEGA scope 3D system and on the back here, screenshots from a bunch of uh, different games. So, that's really cool. Uh, let's see if I can fold this back here. There we go. So, uh, that's uh, Captain Silver, and let's continue here, we have uh, Action Fighter, and this is a game I have, but uh, this one is uh, complete, which mine isn't, so that's uh, the reason I bought this. And manual there. Uh, this looks to be in better condition than the one I have so I will be replacing mine. Then we have a game that I didn't have and it's uh, the New Zealand story. And apparently this uh, uh, cost uh, 15 Deutsche Mark And it is uh, also complete. Next one here is uh, Pit Fighter. And this is complete. And then we have uh, Xenon uh, 2 uh, Mega Blast. And this also cost uh, 15 Deutsche Mark some, <laughs> some time ago. Um, and this should be complete as well. And it is. I don't know why these uh, manuals are all backwards here. There we go, it's uh, Xenon. And uh, then we have a Heavyweight Champ. And this one is not complete, it's uh, cart only. But I think that's the only game that doesn't have the manual. Uh, next one here is uh, Great uh, Baseball. And this is complete. Uh, 
and then we have a strider and that one is complete and we have the clacks complete and then we have a, a pretty rare game actually and it's uh, uh, Daffy Duck in uh, Hollywood and that one is complete and we have Kung Fu Kid and that is complete and there seems to be another poster in here I can get it out here and it's uh, basically the same as uh, the other one Got an overview of the systems here and the extra stuff here. And on the back we have the screenshots. So let's see here, there's uh, one final game here, and that is uh, Transpot. And this I have on uh, Sega card, but uh, I wanted it on, uh, on cartridge as well. And this is also complete. And there's another poster in here. See if it's uh, the same one. Yeah, yeah, it looks to be the same one. So I got uh, uh, three extra posters that I didn't know were included. So that's a nice surprise. Uh, but yeah, that's uh, that was transport, and uh, that was uh, the last game in the package. So. That was everything that I picked up, all the Master System games, the PS2, and uh, the two or actually three PS2 games. And uh, that's all I had to show you this time, so bye for now, and I'll see you soon.